this is what we got going on today boys sorry about the wind gonna try to keep you guys out of it minimum decoys today special little hunt going on we are sitting by the cattle scratch again uh where me and frederick did uh the solo hunt and we are ready to go bub are you you getting them on yeah are you well, I'll, I'll help you in a minute you don't need them yet bodie's got his ear protection bodie's got a shotgun let's keep this remember we keep it held up in the air muzzle up today is uh pigeon hunting with dad isn't it you excited today we're gonna uh, just a little practice for Bubba uh, before he gets his real gun one of these days, huh? We got to practice and get better, don't we? I know. Give me nuts. That's my boy. As a lot of you know, Bodie is the next generation of waterfowl, of hunting. Bodie and his generation are the ones that we got to teach, right? You still got ketchup all over your face from McDonald's, Bubba. <laughs> He's so sweet. I love hunting with him. Uh, we've been on three hunts together now, but this is Bodie's first pigeon hunt. And like I said, he's got his shotgun today. And Daddy's got his shotgun today. And we got Frederick. So, right off the bat, if you guys, you know it's gonna be a banger. You, if you guys appreciate this video, smash a thumbs up for Bodie and I. Let's get this video, I don't know, 4K5, surprise me. Surprise Bodie. But first off, I do wanna say big shout out to bucks and ducks huh bub yeah bucks is a deer hunting company ducks is a duck hunting company and thank you to them for always supporting me uh, because if it wasn't for them i would not be able to still bring you guys these videos so just be honest about it and at bucks and at ducks one of our main thing is to teach the next generation the ropes and this is one way to do it take your son and give him his toy shotgun and spray and pray <laughs> But today is going to all be all, oh, look at all these pigeons, Bub. Look. Wow. I'm not ready. We're just going to let them fly over here for a minute. Ooh, are you ready, buddy? Yeah. But all the buck gear, if you're a deer hunter, it will be linked down below, as well as if you're a duck hunter, these new hats hit the ground running August 24th. Go grab you one before they're gone. All righty. Those birds just flew right over us, didn't they, Bub? You good to go on your ear protection? That's my guy. Give me Nux. Let's hold her. Oh, sorry. Left you hanging. Hold your gun up. Muzzle up like always, okay? Make sure you don't point it towards Fred or I, all right? That's my boy. Gotta practice. Gotta practice. Look at all them pigeons over there, buddy. You see them? Watch. Over in that other field. There's a bunch over there. It's a little warmer, a little humid. It's sitting right at 89 degrees. Not too bad. But we don't have to shoot a bunch. Just a couple is all. Oop, they're coming back up front. Don't move. Ready? Oh! Didn't get him all the way, bub. Right here, Fred. Heel. Good. Sit. That was a swing and a miss by Dad. I thought I smoked him. You good? Yep. High five? We missed. Yep, don't put your finger on the trigger yet, okay? We hold it like this until we're ready. Oh, right here, buddy. Right here, ready? Oof. Get ready, buddy. Don't move. Here they come. Oh, look at this. We got two. You see them? Yep. <laughs> sit down, sit down. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. Was that awesome? <laughs> I saw them go down. Yeah. Did you aim at them? You got to pull up your gun. That's what we're what's what we're practicing. It, look, if Daddy pulls up, you pull up, okay? Okay. Fred, was that pretty cool? Yeah. Yeah. Fred's gonna get that bird for us. Good here. That was awesome. Up? Yep, you can take it out of his mouth. Drop. Let's see it. Hold it up, buddy. Let's see it. Oh, what do you got? You got a blue check. Awesome. That was a pretty bird. 
Fred, one more to pick up. Yep. Smash that thumbs up button. Come on, guys. Tell them, buddy. Tell them. Dead bird. Tell them. Dead bird. Dead bird. Got here. There we go. Drop. Stop. Take it from him, buddy. Hold that one up. What do you got there? Oh, you got a blue bar. One of each. Look at you. That's an older one. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Put it in our pile out back. Yeah. Good job, buddy. We so got that, two pretty birds. We got two pretty birds. And next time, here, Fred, here. Set. Good. Good boy. No breaking. Good dog. Uh, next time, you got to aim at the bird with daddy, okay? okay. All right. Do you have a sock on that? Yeah, there's a sock on it, isn't there? That's for the wind. That a boy picking up our shells. Thank you. We'll just sit them right here in a pile. Got yeah, that a guy. All right, let's get sat down before the next birds come. Hope oh, one on the right coming, buddy. Don't move. Look at him coasting in here. See him? Mm -hmm. Here he comes. Fred. I seen you aim at him. Did you aim at him? <laughs> Give me nuts. That's my boy. Were you aiming right at him? Cock and load, bud. Drop. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, that's a really old bird. That's an older bird. That's a blue bar. Awesome. Good job, Fred. Here you go. You can put him in the pile. I used to hold him like on the belly. Yep. Pick up your gun, Bubba. Fred, set. Good. Set. Good boy. Bubba, you gonna take over Sand Hill Flyaway one day from Daddy? Are you? Are you sure? What do you want to be when you grow up? You can be whatever you want to be. A pigeon hunter. A pigeon hunter? Bubba, what do you really want to be when you grow up? What have you told me before? Huh? Keeper. Ooh, a pet keeper? Yeah. Might be able to do that. That's not a bad idea. We have a huge group out front. Bubba, get ready. This might get squirrely. Yeah, they're re it is really windy today, isn't it, buddy? Thank goodness we're behind this. This is the old cattle back scratcher, and it gives a really good windbreak here, thank goodness. Huh? Does it wash cards? No. Cattle go underneath it to scratch the flies off their back. Yep. Here's two right out front, Bubba. When I pull up, you pull up. Are they going to come over the top? Nope, we can't shoot that way. But we can shoot this way, Bubba. We're coming over the top. Get ready. You aimed up? Yep. All right. Here they come. Yep, here they come. We got one. Fred! We got one, didn't we? Good shooting. Careful with your gun. Oh, you want to get the bird? Get it from Frederick. Stop, Fred. Stop. Take it from him. Take it from him. Heel. Fred, heel. Good boy. Good. You got a black one there. Let's see it, buddy. Hold it up. Ooh, that's a black bar. Look at that. That's really cool. Put it in our pile. That a boy. How many we got back there? Set. Oh, no. We'll count them. We got one, two, three, four. We got right on the money four. All right, sit down, buddy. Here's one out front. One out front. Get your gun. Hurry. Set. There he goes. Oh, oh don't move. Shh. They're going to turn around. Here they come. Oh, he was really close and daddy missed again. <laughs> no bird. Oh, get them shells. That's my boy. This one's a hot shell. Yeah, it is. That's the one daddy just shot. The pigeon was by decoys. Yeah, is that why they come to us? Yep. They like the decoys, like this one right here. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe not, Bubba. Uh, so today, we have 24 pigeon decoys out they are full bodies i've had so many questions about hey bobby what 
type of decoys are, are those those are wing king and they don't make them anymore they haven't made them for a handful of years actually i just try to take decent care of them but two dozen decoys out there uh no mojo you don't need motion because they want to be here so badly and an afternoon hunt one thing i found with this is a little side tip for all you honker hunters up there when you're scouting in the mornings whatever you find in the morning you need to hunt in the morning if you're scouting in the afternoon whatever you find in the afternoon hunt in the afternoon because it seems like birds in general whether it's pigeons honkers uh during this hot weather right now they are uh they have two different fields one in the morning one in the evening so it's two different schedules i would say hunt accordingly and you'll do better there you go aim at him fred he was close wasn't he yeah <laughs> he was real close Woo! You gotta grab it out of his mouth. Say drop. drop Fred. Say drop. Oh, drop. hold on. He needs his. He needs his neck run. Oh. Whoops. Oh, look at that. Oh. You ready, Bob? Fred, got one. <laughs> Give me nut. Yeah. yeah. That was a lot of birds, wasn't it? Yeah. That was a bunch of birds. Drop, Fred. Drop, set. Drop. Take it from him. Drop. Drop. Good. Oh my goodness, what's that, bub? It looks like a homer. Sure isn't. Look at that, that's a big bird. Mm -hmm. Not quite like a homer. Oh, sit down, bud. Oh, got him, Fred. <laughs> that was a long shot! Woo! That was sweet! Pick up them shells, Bubba. That a boy. That's my boy. Look at him. Picking up dad's shells. That's my helper. Teaching him the right way. Here, Fred, here. Come on. Right here, right here, right here. My bird. Oh, sit down. Here comes a bunch. Sit down. Hurry, hurry. One up top. Oh, there's a bunch. They just keep coming back and forth, don't they? Oh, here. Get ready, buddy. Get ready. Set. Fred. Hey. Atta boy. He, they do it real nice. They're just floating in them decoys, aren't they, buddy? Yep. Yeah. Good. Drop. Sit. Drop. See, they need their heads rung sometimes, don't they? Yeah. There you go. What do we got? That is a good looking blue bar, buddy. He has long wings. He's got big wings. It's a starling. Earlier, you guys hopefully seen me pull up. That's a juvie little starling there. Can I hold it? Yeah. That's a young little starling right there, buddy. Mm -hmm. Let me see him. Yeah. Yep, he didn't like us. He went the other way. There's four more right here. We got one. Fred. We got one, didn't we, buddy? Yeah. Yeah. Good. Here. They came out of nowhere. This wind. Whoo. They come out of nowhere. Quick. Quick. Drop. Drop. Good. What do you got, Bubba? Show us. You got a blue bar. Good looking bird. Good job, Bubba. Put it in her pile. Oh, there goes one. Lay down. Good boy. What's this? What's this called? Trigger. What's this called? Mm. Safety. One. Yep, I said, oh, he's coming, isn't he? Think he's going to come to us? Mm -hmm. Better get your gun ready. Got a boy. 
Eh, he might go. Ooh, look at all them. Wow. That's a bunch, Bubba. Don't move. Here we go. Don't move. Oh. Oh, he's going down, Fred. Oh, that took Daddy four shells to get that guy. What? Thank you for cleaning them up for me, Papa. <laughs> that way, he was so close. I could not hit him. Finally, good drop. Ring it. Oh, we gotta ring his neck, buddy. There we go. Another one in the pile. Good here. Fred, you ready for some water? We're gonna take you to the pond here in one second. Good job, buddy. We gotta take him to the water. Yeah, we're gonna take him. Let him go cool off in the water. Here, buddy, come sit down. We're not done. Now I'm doing it. I'm good at hunting. You're good at hunting? You are good at hunting. That's my boy. I like how you keep our mess cleaned up for daddy and everything. That's a good hunter. Leaving it how you found it, huh? I should have shot him. Well, just had a collared dove land five yards from us, and I didn't shoot him. Here, Fred. Bubba. Remember? Huh? I don't know why you like that starling don't you buddy yeah. that's a young starling here let's put him down for a minute looky what's that called Figure. and we only touch it oh there's a bird in the decoys we only touch it oh hold on get ready get your gun up right up top oh daddy just smoked him Fred! We'll get it get it from Frederick when he brings it back. Good boy. Fred, drop. 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 Let's see what he is. What do we got? Blue bar. Blue bar. Yep, another one to the pile. Here you go. Like I was saying, Bubba, come here. Lay down. Here, Bubba. Come here, buddy. Good job, buddy. That's my boy. Bubba, we only touch the trigger when we're ready to shoot, right? When we're, when we're not shooting, look, we keep our finger off of the trigger, okay? What's this called? Safety. That's right. We always keep our safety on until we're ready to shoot, right? That's my boy. Yep, go ahead, put your starling in there. We shot one starling. How many pigeons? Wanna count them? One, two, three, four, five. No, one, two, three, four, five. Six. Oh. <laughs> there went a pigeon right there. Look, he's gonna decoy again. Keep counting. Nope, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven pigeons and one starling. We've been here, as you can tell, Bodie's face is getting red. We're getting hot. We just had to let Fred get a drink of the water, let him swim to cool off. It's hot. It's hot. We're done. That's good enough. We've only been here for, for about 45 minutes. That's all we needed to do good little spot thank you to the farmer again Gary for letting me bring my son out here and enjoy a short afternoon you ready to go home yep. here bub put your put your stuff why do you like that starling so much put him in the bucket put him in there there you go get you a good drink again here you go big drink look at Fred he's like can I have a drink dad <laughs> Is that fun? Yeah. You want to do it again with Daddy? Did you learn something? Yeah. Yeah, we did. We learned gun safety, didn't we? Give me another Nux. All right, I'm Bubba. Watch. Under yep. Him. Crawl, crawl on the ground. Nope. Crawl on the ground. Watch out. All the way down. 
There's a hot wire right here. Here's your gun. Watch out for that hot wire, it hurts. Hey Fred, here, come on. Let's go. Let's tell him to get in the water right here. Come on. Come on, Fred. Go, Fred. Go. Go on. There he goes. Hold on, stay up here. It's steep. Oh, he says that feels good. Oh, you hot, buddy? Yeah. Yeah, you ready to go home and get in the AC? Yeah. Yeah. And when we get home, we gotta clean the lodge. <laughs> when we get home, we gotta clean the lodge? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we will. Woo, it's hot. Oof. So hot, in fact. The first thing Bodie said, Daddy, I don't want to do that again because it's just too hot. And I said, I know, hunting season, hunting birds in general is just better in the winter. Isn't it, little man? Yeah. It is 92 degrees. Thank goodness for the wind today, though. Oh. Bodie always locking the doors. Come on, let's go. Oh, hi, Fred. Were you comfortable? Come on. Come on, old dog. You're not old at all. Don't even act like it, boy. But check it out. I did get some mail in the P.O. box. Uh-huh. A lot of y'all forgot that I have a P.O. box. And if you want to ever send something, it's always, every single video I post down in the description, the P.O. box is always linked down there. Come on, Fred. Inside. Come on. He's a tired, tired dog. <laughs> Is he tired, bub? Are you tired? No. You watching YouTube already, man? That was the first thing Bodie said. Let's go back to the lodge, turn on the AC, dad, and watch some TV. He's ready to relax. I can guarantee you when I put down the camera and we get this bad boy cooled off, he's gonna be taking a nap in here. This is the best place to nap, only when the AC's on. Whew, it's hot. First of all, before we get to opening the P.O. Box mail, I want to tell y'all um, we have one more North Dakota video coming y'all for y'all. Uh, it's the last goose hunt from North Dakota from the North Dakota trip as y'all have been on and seen. Uh, first of all, I want to tell y'all thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for all of the just massive support for all the North Dakota videos. Y'all have loved them. And number two, before we get to opening the mail here, Bucks and Ducks, always link down below. I will link Bucks down below as well as August 24th, that new Ducks exclusive camo. That hat, it'll be dropping the 24th of August. Get them before they are all just gone. All right, here we go. This one here, man, it got wet. It was in the garage and it kind of got wet. I hope it didn't mess it up. This says to Bobby P. Diddy and pals. So, Old Preston's supposed to be here opening this one with me. Hope you all can see me. What do we have? We have... What's that? What are these? That is a whistle of some sort. A homemade whistle. I bet it's a dog whistle. What do you want to bet? Dear Bobby, Preston, and pals, as admirers as admirers of your show and antics, we wanted to send you something to say thanks for your pleasure you have given us over the last 12 months. I know you don't get a lot of gifts from your brothers across the pond. Ah. Oh, wow. In the summer months, we spend our time in Africa guiding hunts out there. Everything from high pheasants to the best wood pigeon shooting in the world. UK fur and fowl on Instagram. Wow. That would be amazing to go out there. We hope this whistle uh, finds you well and serves you well. So cool. Thank you, Michael and Alex. I've been needing one. That is it. Look, Fred's like. There we go. Dog whistles, ideal for waterfowling. They sent us three of them. Ooh, Fred just spices right up. Thank you, Michael and Alex. Thanks, guys. Homemade dog whistles. I'm gonna put that bad boy in my lanyard. I'm gonna give 
Gerald won and someone else won. Probably P. Diddy. All right. <clears throat> Thank you, Michael and Alex. Again, the P.O. box. Again, the P.O. box is always linked down below. Let's see what's in here. We got a lot of foam and stuff. It might take me a minute here. Hold on, Bodie. Hold on, buddy. Want to come over here and see what we got? Come here. Oh, what's this? What's this, bud? Oh, yes! Come, come, come check this out. Oh, look at this. Hopefully it came with a note. Look, someone sent us another vintage decoy. Isn't that cool? Look at that. That's an old one. So, if y'all are new here, um, last year we were building the whole lodge and I have every bit of 20 to 30 vintage decoys uh, just showcased around the lodge. <coughs> that was the biggest thing last year. That was so cool. You guys sent so many. This is a Carry Light Dura Beak. Carry Light Dura Beak. I can tell it's foam and at one time it was like canvas or some type of, type of flocking on it. Hopefully he sent a note. Oh, here we go. Here's a note. Here we go. Bob, Fred, and family. I have, I have watched your videos for a while now. I enjoy that you are able to take your father with you uh, when you magnet fish. You are making great memories. I enjoy your goose hunting videos also. I probably will not be able to afford a guided hunt. Okay. I have enclosed a really old duck decoy that my uh, that I hope you can preserve. Hopefully by the time you post a video of this, my wife and I will have our new home in Texas. So I hope so, man. I have just passed my one year anniversary on my channel. Oh, cool. You got a channel too. Mr. Steve Kurtz, uh, Redhead Adventures. Thank you. This is uh, wishing you and yours the best. You too, Steve. Thank you for sending this, man. So awesome. Other small YouTube channels, big, small. Waterfowling should be a community. And um, I really, really, really mean that. Times are getting to where uh, people are bickering and complaining about everything. and Friendships are falling, it seems. And um, it's just unfortunate. But it's life, I guess. You gotta deal with things, some things, and you gotta move along. But check out this. Some of you have seen this, some of you haven't. That is a skateboard, a blank, that my buddy Jeremy from Canada did. He's a tattoo artist up there, Jeremy Zettler. He sent that. <sighs> so sweet. Thank you guys for sending all of the great gifts. Uh, it really pleases my heart that uh, on the fifth year of the channel's lifespan here, we still have and are growing more and are gathering more wholesome individuals to spread the good love, passion, nature, ethics, huge one. Ethics is a huge one to the next generation, just like Bodie and I today. That's what it was about. That was his first time ever holding a gun at all on any type of hunt. And did you have fun, buddy? Yeah. Yeah, are you ready to watch some TV? <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I, hold on, I'm almost done. He's ready to chill out and relax. We've been swigging water. Hold, look. He's tired too. The heat will just take it out of you. But spread uh, the good word of waterfowl hunting. Spread the good word of ethics. Make sure you're wringing necks uh, and not letting birds flop around too long. And, and just take care of it like you should, like nature wants us to do, like we should. Okay? But subscribe if you haven't. Hit that little notification bell down there because it will tell you when I upload. It's literally just a notification that pops up on your phone and you can click it and watch a video. It's like a little reminder. It's really cool. You can ignore it or you can hit it. Up to you. But until next time. Tell everybody peace, bub. Peace. <laughs>